Hi there, everybody. It's Heather Nunez Olmstead from Umpy Center for Teaching and Learning, and I want to walk you through an amazing resource that we have to help us with our research uh, across classes, and that is utilizing the RefWorks tool at the Umpy Library. So you can see here that I'm at the Umpy Library, which you can get to through umpy.edu or just through typing umpy.edu backslash library. And when I go down into the library page here, I'm going to go to the OneSearch. And here I can see the search bar, and I actually explored OneSearch in another video. But what I want to do is I want to look at the top right hand here. And you can see that I have saved items. And when I click on the little hamburger menu there, I can open up a menu and it allows me to log in. So I need to make sure that I'm logging in from my institution. If you haven't signed up for an account, you'll have to sign up for an account here. It only takes a couple minutes to use that gray button. Once you've already created your account, you can just simply log in with your main.edu. And then you can see once I log in with my password there are a couple of things that i can notice when i click the hamburger menu now it tells me that i'm logged in as me and i can see instead of the save i can click on that folder and it says pro quest ref works so let's just really quickly go back to the library search and maybe i want to search in here study skills for college freshman and I can go through and highlight all of the elements that I want to make sure that I have intact and then potentially I can find um, a resource that I think is really really good so as I'm looking at it you can see that now I can save this item and when I click the little sideways snowman, I can actually export that to my ref work. So that's writing motivation for college students. And yes, I want to export it to my new ref works. And maybe I want to put it in a folder for um, first year, since that's a class, and I want to import it. So I can see here I have a couple of folders. Um, one folder is stuff that I've just saved, and the other one is for a specific class, which is first year. And as I go down through in these articles that I have collected, I can see that I have several of them. I can really quickly eyeball for currency. So this one's from 2016. However, I have one down here that is from uh, 1990 so I might want to think about okay is that one that I want to keep and is really useful do I need something more current when I'm ready I can actually use everything that I've collected in my ref works and I can create a bibliography and I can choose what style I would like to use so I actually want to have APA. It tells me sixth edition. We're actually in seventh edition. I can also type in MLA. I'll go back to APA. And now you can see that I have complete citations um, with the hanging indent. And I can copy to a clipboard and add that to my Word document or doc document. Um, so that's one great thing that RefWorks can help us with citing specifically. The other thing that I can do is I can add a folder for every class that I have to do research for. And I can really easily drag and drop items to different folders as well. So if I look at this one particular resource here, when I click on it, I can see some of the basic information for it. And I can also assign it to the folder that I just created. Now you can see that that's there. I can also add tags if I just have keywords that I want to make sure that I look at. And I can also share my list with specific people for, say, a group project 
or maybe I just want to share resources with a professor to say, hey, does this look good so far as far as my research goes? When I click that button to create a public URL, that's the URL that you can share with. When you click the Add button, you can also upload a document if you have a document from your class that you just want to um, create a citation for or add to a folder, or you can create a new reference. Now, the nice thing about RefWorks specifically is it allows you to take your research, your iterative research across classes and across semesters and academic years and look up articles and bibliographies that you've created in the past, which is actually really helpful as you're entering your senior year and looking at capstones and reflecting somewhat on um, your learning journey and trying to put all those elements of all your classes together. So RefWorks is a really great tool available to all UMPI students. If you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to reach out to Alan Morrill and the Friendly Library staff. I went ahead and am posting that link right in this video. So please utilize this tool because it is available and open to everybody on the UMPI campus, regardless of whether you're an in-person student, online, or you're a PACE student. Happy researching!